brought to you by Snacky Spores, the creamy fun of spores and a delightful cookie crunch. Man, somebody's at the door. Coming, hun. I can't see the TV. It's been six weeks since Saddam Hussein was killed by a pack of wild boars, and the world is still glad to be rid of him. Oh, look, Eric, it's your little friends. Funny man. What are you guys doing here? Oh, sweet, dude. Yes, yes. Off to the movies we shall go, where we learn everything that we know. Because the movies teach us what our parents don't have time to say. And this movie's going to make our lives complete. Because Terrence and Philip are sweet. Give me sweet. Thank God we live in the quiet little redneck podunk white trash. Woo -woo. You. The controversy began in the small mountain town of South Park, where the local PTA is trying to ban the movie. With us tonight is the head of the PTA, Sheila Broflowski. Hello, Tom. And the Canadian Minister of Movies. Thanks for having me, buddy. Minister, parents are concerned about your country's entertainment. Your thoughts? Well, the film is R-rated, and it's not intended for children. Ah, but of course children are going to see it. Can I finish? The fact is that we Canadians are quite surprised by you your outrage. You just don't care. Uh, can I finish? Hello, can I, can I finish? The United States has graphic violence on television all the time. The city exploded, destroying thousands of lives and leaving a city in turmoil. Anger raged in the streets like never before. The police officers and the officers have uh, taken another person into custody. Today, activists are speaking out against the NYPD, claiming officers used excessive force during yesterday's crackdown. We can't believe that a movie with some foul language would piss you off so much. Because it's evil! Can I finish? Please, can I finish? I saw tear gas, um, pepper spray. Uh, you know, I saw them take a woman by the neck and throw her onto the concrete. Okay, I'm finished. But, Mr. Minister, it isn't like this film is the first troublesome thing to come out of Canada. Let us not forget Brian Adams. No, no, the Canadian government has apologized for Brian Adams on several occasions. You Canadians are all the same with your beady little eyes and flapping heads. You, you trash! I resent that. I find that racist. And Our children are now addicted you to your You are a racist, film. man. You are a racist. It is going to take us weeks to erase the damage this film has done to our children. You can do it. It's all up to you, kind. With a little plan, you can change your life to die. You don't have to spend your life addicted to smack. Homeless on the streets giving hand jobs for crack. Follow my plan and very soon you will say it's easy and good. Step one, instead of ass, say buns. Like kiss my buns or you're a buns hole. Warning, assholes are closer than they appear. Ooh. Two things, you keep your liver spotted hands off my beautiful mother, she's a saint. And then you sit down and you write Dale and Brennan a check for $10,000. Oh, or I'm going to shove one of those fake hearing devices so far up your ass. Brennan. You can hear the sound of your small intestine as it produces shit. Step two instead of shit, say poo, as in bull poo poo, head in this poo is cold. I've seen some pretty shitty situations in my life, but nothing has ever sucked more ass than this. Smashing, Basil. Cool. This coffee smells like shit. It is shit, Austin. Oh, good, then it's not just me. When a shit apple falls from a tree and grows up in a field of shit, it doesn't have any choice, just like Trinity. She's gonna grow up to be a shit apple tree, just like her father. Have fun in jail, Rick. Step three with bitch, drop the tea, cause Big is Latin for generosity. What's your name? Fat Amy. Um, you call yourself... Fat Amy? Yeah, it's a twig bitch is like, you don't do it behind my back. Bitches are cut the bricks! Wild card, bitches! Yeah! Step forward, don't say fuck anymore, cause fuck is the worst word that you can say. So just use the word okay. Fuck, 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 Fuck off. You fuck off. Fuck fucking off. Nobody fucks with the Jesus. Fuck you! When you're out there in the battlefield and you're looking into the beady eyes of a Canadian as he charges you with his hockey stick or whatever he has, and people are dying all around you, just remember what the MPAA says. Horrific, deplorable violence is okay as long as people don't say any naughty words. That is what this war is all about. The first 
Us is a boat taking our citizens. It's a boat not censoring our art. It's a boat. It's a boat. <laughs> What's so goddamn funny? <laughs> not, nothing, nothing. Uh, could you tell us again what your argument is all about? This is about more than fart jokes. This is about freedom of speech, about censorship, and stuff. Cut the fucking face, Uncle Fat. <laughs>